This video is a range test of Surf FM. 87.6 Surf FM. Surf FM is licensed to have an output power of around 1 watt. Looking at Google Street View, it has an antenna height, maybe 15 metres or so. I'm just using an entry level DAB radio, which also has FM, and seems to be quite sensitive. I won't use any external antenna. This is reception in my backyard, about 9 to 10 kilometres from the transmitting site. Having said that, Surf FM has another transmitter in another direction, but without a directional antenna, I can't tell which is which. The signal is too weak to identify, but luckily the train goes almost straight past the transmitter site, so I'll be able to find out for sure in a few minutes. I'm sitting on the correct side of the train for the station, and at about four kilometres away, it's still not audible. Here at about three kilometres away, we're starting to do signals. The station is located 100 metres, just past this intersection. We're only about a kilometre south, but as you could hear, there is a bit of a dead spot and the station became less audible. Now we're in downtown Frankston, pretty dead at 8 o'clock on a Sunday morning. The station is mostly fully quieting, but there is some hissy bits. hospitals at Frankston where it's elevated and about two kilometers south of the transmitter site. This is near Tower Hill Road with an apt name of one of the highest points in Frankston. Surf FM is audible but not listenable. Just to summarise, 1 watt FM seems to cover about 1 to 3 kilometres. But even within that radius, there are parts where the signal can get noisy, 